So I was sitting at this traffic light the other day on a three-lane road. There were vehicles all around me, three on the front, one on either side, three on the back. And of those vehicles, not one was a car. They were all SUVs. And that got me thinking, when did this SUV thing really start? Well, I can't really answer that, but I do have what I think is one of the first with me today. That's a 1977 Toyota Land Cruiser SJ43, and this is a very classic two-minute test drive. So joining me today is this FJ's owner, Sam. Sam, fill us in on the particulars of this while I try to figure out what I'm doing here. Yeah, Russ, so it's a 4.2 inline six. It's got a four-speed manual with low and high four-wheel drive. Now, the inside looks fairly sparse to me. I don't see a heater, I don't see radio, I don't see anything. No, you got nothing, <laughs> none of that. Reverses. Yeah, down there you go. Whoa, long brake pedal. <laughs> now, we have no air conditioning, I'm guessing, but the roof does come down if we really wanted to. Yeah, if we really wanted to, we could take the top off. It's a bit of a job, but we can get it done. The sides roll up, Yeah. and down here, you've got a little kick vents. That's what I call the oh, AC. Kind of cool. that'll, that'll cool you off. The steering feels Okay, not, not as direct as some of the cars we've driven, obviously. Now, this one came from Colombia. Yes, this, it was restored and active in Colombia throughout its years. We found it on an online auction. It's been a, a pretty fun thing for me and my dad to work on in the garage. Are we in four-wheel drive or two-wheel drive now? We're in two-wheel drive right now. Two-wheel drive, so it's driving through the rear, rear wheel. Yeah, yep. to engage the four-wheel drive, you gotta lock the hubs on the yep. two front wheels. Yeah. You gotta be careful with, with doing that though, because if you were to engage it, just yeah. drive it on the street like this, yeah. it would wreck the whole transfer case. Oh, yeah, no, we don't wanna do that. Yeah, it's, it's really just for like if I'm stuck. I could see where you get attracted to this pretty quick, cause it's kinda cool just to cruise along in the country with it, right? Okay, let's talk about the seating in this. Uh, they're very basic seats. You got two people up front, you got three in each of the back seats. We, I think we've had nine people total. All right, let's get this thing set up for off-road. So now, first, hill descent control. How do, how do I set that up? Just watch out when you're going down the hill. Really? <laughs> okay. What about uh, traction control, stability management? Nothing. What kind of brakes does this have? Drums all around. Yep. Sam, I think it's time you drive. <laughs> Sounds good, Russ. <laughs> That's pretty good for two-wheel drive. Oh, yeah. I knew she could do it. <laughs> I can see if you took this FJ and added 40 something years of development, you would have come up with what is now today's SUV. So maybe this is where it all started. But one thing's for sure, those of today will never have the style or the character that this one does. Right, Sam? Yep, can't beat this. I'm Sam Baker, and this has been a classic two minute test drive. I can drive the off road now. Nope. <laughs> So here's the question, where were you 32 years ago? I know some of you weren't even a glint in your father's eye. As for me, well, I was in diapers, but found time to get motoring TV off the ground. And today I like to think we've got one of the best automotive video libraries in the world. If you agree, please give us the thumbs up and also subscribe. We really appreciate it.